guys welcome back today I have a holiday winter tag 2019 so if you guys are interested then keep on watching okay this tag I don't know if it was actually started by Sean from uh, hearth and soul that's his channel name hearth and soul and I'll have the uh, channel link down in my description box in case you guys want to go over there and check out his channel he does candle reviews mostly bath and body work candles and uh, he does an amazing job so if you want to know what's going on about the candles check out his channel and excuse me guys I'm a little under the weather getting a little cold or something so I'm not feeling that good but you know what that's okay this is a holiday and I'm gonna push through this tag okay all right question number one <clears throat> And where are my questions? Okay. Question number one, real tree or artificial tree? Um, I like both of them. I always buy artificial trees, I guess, because, you know, you can use them year after year after year. And then the real trees, you have to throw it away. So that's it's a little bit of a waste of money to me. So, But I do like both of them. Two, colored lights or white lights? I like both, but now I'm all into the white lights. So it's always white, especially for inside the house, uh, the Christmas tree. Three, open presents, Christmas Day or, no, Christmas Eve or Christmas Day. Of course, Christmas Day. I cannot open my gifts the day before. No way. That just spoils the moment, doesn't it? No, I can't do that. Number four, your favorite holiday food. Mmm. Oh boy, you're making me hungry. <laughs> um, I like all holiday food. The traditional, like the macaroni and cheese. Um, I don't even eat any of these foods anymore, guys, and you guys know that, but macaroni and cheese, I like to have enchiladas. I like to have tamales chicken tamales, pork tamales, beef tamales, they're just all so delicious. I like to have potato salad, um, sweet potato pies, <laughs> am I making you hungry? So those are some of the foods that I like. Mm, I'm getting hungry. <laughs> Number five, holiday, no, five, favorite holiday dessert, I just said it, sweet potato pie, all the way. Six, fragrances you love around the holiday season, candle or non-candle. I like a lot of different uh, fragrances, but I don't know quite what the name of, of them are. Um, but I do know that I like apple, anything apple, um, some cinnamons, but nothing with pumpkin. Nothing pumpkin. Uh, you can have pumpkin, but it has to have cinnamon with pumpkin or apple or you know some other type of flavor but uh, anything that smells good that's all I can say seven your favorite Christmas present now when I read this question I didn't quite understand your favorite Christmas present I guess they're what they're asking is what was your favorite Christmas present from the past or what's your favorite Christmas present that you would like to receive um, my BMW car yes that will be my favorite present my BMW number eight your favorite holiday movie oh man why did you ask that question it's called a Christmas blessing and the reason why I say that's because guys our cable uh, provider is not putting it on anymore so I don't know what's going on with that movie I guess they've played it so many times and they just said okay no more or maybe the ratings wasn't that high but you know what every time they put that movie on I was watching it every single night I get in the bed and that was it my husband and son knew okay when mom watches a Christmas blessing don't bother her <laughs> I tell you, I love that movie. Oh my gosh. And I was even looking for it, you know, to see if they were going to play it this season. And I don't see it anywhere. So I'm a little bummed out about it. 
But anyway, that's my favorite movie. Number nine, your favorite holiday song or Christmas carol. Silent Night. That's it, Silent Night. I have a lot of them, but I would have to say Silent Night is probably my number one favorite. Um, I can't think of any Christmas carols off the top of my head right now while doing this video, but pretty much singing all of the traditional holiday songs, Silent Night, um, Harp the Herald Angels Singing, um, Jingle Bells, you know, all of the traditional songs I like. Number 10, your favorite holiday tradition or one you would like to start? Hmm, well, my favorite one that we always do every year, and that's get in the car and go watch the, the lights down the streets of all the houses and just have your hot chocolate or your coffee. And we have a good time. We laugh and it's cold. We have the heater on in the car. Uh, that's my favorite. That's pretty much what we do. Um, one that I would like to start, oh wow, I don't know. I have to think on that one, but I'm pretty sure I could think of something that I would love to start, but not right now. Number 11, how long do you keep your Christmas tree up? I keep my Christmas tree up until January the 1st, after New Year's, after the parade, honey it's towards the evening time is coming down <laughs> I tell you I cannot keep my Christmas tree up towards nighttime the next day um, the week after the month after months after like some people do and there's nothing wrong with it but that's not me girl when the first comes everything comes down tree lights decor everything What's your favorite thing about winter? Ah, when we have it, the snow. I love the cold weather. Um, I love, trying not to put these on, but I can't read my writing. Oh, I love snuggling up next to the fireplace on the couch, get your nice coffee, your hot cocoa, your favorite blanket, you have your fuzzy socks on, your bathrobe. I mean, am I painting the picture pretty good? That's pretty much what I like about winter and um, just the cold, freezing temperatures. I love it, love it, love it. Now some of you are saying, girl, you just don't know about our weather out here on the East Coast. No, I don't. <laughs> but I always say that every year and I mean that, I guess because we live in California and we get cold, freezing temperatures, but nothing like back east like you guys from the Midwest. I know. Love it. All right, number 14. Favorite thing to do on a cold, this says blustery winter day. I'm only assuming it's blistery. Blustery? Blustery. Um, I pretty much said it. Uh, cuddle up on the couch with your warm fuzzy socks, your bathrobe, fireplace, your loved one. <laughs> Your sweetheart, that's what I mean. But anyway, yeah, that's pretty much what I like to do and uh, watch a nice holiday movie. Oh man, that's what I feel like doing now. After I finish this tag, I'm going to get my coffee and try to lay down and rest so I can, you know, feel better. Um, number 15, do you go out for New Year's Eve or do you stay in? Well, in the past, we will go out sometimes, but nowadays, we just pretty much stay in. There's not really much going on, I mean, as far as like parties, uh, things of that nature, you know, with our families, pretty much everyone is at home doing their own thing, you know, so that's pretty much what we do. And it's even safer being at home. It's not really that safe going out with these drunk drivers. And that's one reason why I don't want to be out outside driving, especially on the freeways. No, mm -mm. no. Okay, 16, last major question. Do you, oh, do you make New Year's resolutions? 
No, I don't. I make and I set realistic goals. And I work towards them every day, every month, every week, every month, every year to achieve them. I make goals that I'm really working on, things that I really want to come to pass, because resolutions, in my opinion, resolutions are just temporary. People say, oh, I'm gonna start uh, exercising, I'm gonna start eating healthy uh, come January 1st on Monday. That's a resolution. A goal is to say, I'm going to lose 50 pounds and I'm going to work towards it and actually do the necessary steps to achieve it. So that's why I say I make realistic goals. Okay, that's the end of that set of questions. Now, this is the love it or hate it, and there's six questions. Fruitcake, hate it, yuck, can't stand any cake with fruit pieces in it. Ugh. <laughs> That's gross. Eggnog. Hate it. Mm -mm. I have tasted it, but really I'm not a milk drinker and um, it, I just can't tolerate it. Mm -mm. Number three. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. Oh, well that sounds nice and cozy, but I've never tried it, so I, I can't say whether I hate it or love it. Gingerbread. Hate it. Mm -mm. Nasty. Spicy gumdrops. Well, I've never had spicy gumdrops. I've had regular gumdrops and I love gumdrops. So, I probably would like spicy, as long as it's not too hot, because I like spicy food. So, I'm going to say love it. And last one, candy canes. Who does not like candy canes? I love it. Love candy canes. Well, that is all the tag questions that I have for you guys. Now, I'm tagging you. If you're watching me on this video, you are officially tagged. So I would love to hear your answers. This is a nice, fun time of the year to do these type of tag questions. And for those of you who do not know, I love, love participating in tags. So always feel free to tag me in any type of tag that you have. Okay guys, if you're new to the channel, welcome, welcome. So glad to have you. And all my returning subscribers, thank you guys so much for tuning back in. And I hope to see your videos on this tag. So thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.